Hello everybody, welcome to the channel. I'm She Sweet, and today we're going to be feeding my Texas Brown Tarantula. Uh, these guys get a pretty bad rep. I don't know why. I absolutely love her, and she is super active. As you can tell, she's just right out there above her hide. Um, and the, her water dish is like a little dirty. I don't know if you can see it back there. But they actually like move quite a bit at like all the time. They're always moving, always pushing around stuff. They're, um, they burrow when they're young, but when they're like older, they kind of just take over st other bur burrows. And she, this is a new uh, setup because I started to grow mold on on this thing right there. This is not it, obviously, but this is a, like one of these hides right here. So that's cork bark, and this is one of those like basic hides you can find them at like PetSmart. It started to grow mold underneath there, and I had one of these before, and it did that for one of my Madagascar uh, Hicksian cockroach enclosure. So I think I'm just gonna like use those from these for my desert geckos. Um, you know, stuff like that, but I'm, I'm just going to stick with cork bark. It's pretty good on mold resistance. And the tank was pretty dry itself. I'm really surprised it started to gather mold. Funny story about this is when I first got her, I, I actually had a nightmare. And I was going to give her away the next day. Because I was just like, I've never, this is my first ever tarantula and when I first got her. Uh, I was like, well, yeah, it's docile. It's supposed to be like one of the most docile. That's why everybody hates on this because it's super docile. And so I was like, okay, it's good, it's good. But when I got her, I was, I wanted to get to, into tarantulas. But I was also terrified of tarantulas. So let's go ahead and check this out. Here's the lone cricket. This is also going to be my capture cup in case, you know, she takes off.
and she is done. I hope you enjoyed the video. I don't know if you're even interested in watching anything like this, if you want to see any future videos like this. Uh, my cousin just gave me an idea because he knows, he knows I have like all this camera equipment, all this stuff, and he was like, hey, you should record it eating, and I would love to record mine eating, but I don't have any cameras, so I did. Anyways, thank you. Hope you enjoyed. If you have any comments, um, like I said, this is my first time. I shot it through an, you know, its little acrylic cage because also this took over an hour to do and I just pretty much cut all the points where she was just chilling and not doing anything out of it. So it seems really fast, but it was over an hour. Anyways, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.